Welcome back to another episode of Fish in Florida. Today I'm with Ketan and we're going What's to be up, doing a Senko challenge. I'm using a Texas rig Senko to start out. He's using a wacky rig and we're going to see which type of Senko catches the most fish. And then halfway through we're going to switch. I'm going to go to a wacky and he's going to use a Texas. Anyways, hopefully we're going to get a bunch of fish. Make sure you guys sub to his channel. It is Ketan Fishes, right? Yes, sir. I'll leave the link to that in the description. Make sure you check it out. But anyways, let's get to fishing and hope you guys enjoy. All right, guys, we made it to our first spot. Got the Texas rig weightless Senko on and hopefully we'll get some fish on this. Here we go, got one. All right, one to one. I think Captain has one for the wacky rig. I just got one for the Texas rig. First bass of the day. Finally landed a fish, just a little guy. See ya. There he goes, let's hopefully get some more. He's now one to one. One for the text rig, one for the wacky rig. Dude, this spot's pretty. What happened? What happened? There were six. There were six. I counted them. That's sick. I'll show you the replay later. I just cast along the wall right here, and you'll pick one. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Oh! Told you, told you. That was sick, dude. Yes. Alright, two, two. Two for the Texas, two for the wacky. Three. Three for the wacky. Yeah. Wacky is winning. Three two. Little bass guys. Another one for the Texas. This is now three two. Wacky is winning. See ya. Got one. All right, guys. Timer went off. I'm now using a wacky. It is like nine to two for the wacky. Wacky's crushing it. Texas only caught two so far. But another little bass, he crushed it. All right, guys, we are at the next spot. It is currently like 10 to 2, or maybe 10 to 3. 10 for the wacky, 3 for the Texas rig. And we are at the next spot. Hopefully, we'll get a bunch of fish. I'm going to switch to the Pisafun Carbon X. Hopefully, get some on the spinning setup. All right, guys, I now put on a weight. I'm using a Texas rig. We kind of finished off the challenge. Now we're just going to mess around, try to catch as many fish as we can. Yeah. And the best way that I feel right here is a weighted Texas rig. Hopefully we'll get a bunch. There was like a six pounder. Oh my God, Captain, you need to hurry up. You need to hurry up. There were six bass chasing my Senko. The smallest one ate it. Guys, that was insane. All right, little bass. I got to throw him back quick. There was so many fish chasing my Senko. I casted there, I was reeling straight in, and like six fish were following it. Okay. Big, 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 Let's go! Oh my god, he choked it. Oh, that's a six. Bro. That's a six. D bro, why is everyone catching stuff at my spot and I'm not? <laughs> Dude, yes. he choked it. I need pliers. Bro. God, I wasn't recording. My GoPro's about to die. Sorry, guys. I just got a stud. Look at this beast, guys. Let's go. Let's go. I told you, this bro. This is a my stud. Spot. That's a freaking giant. All right, guys. Awesome bass on the Piss Fun Phantom. Really solid bass. That's a stud. It's so pretty, too. Look at its lateral line, its colors. Dark fish. Let's get a release. That's so sick. Look at that awesome fish. Ready? Okay. Focus. Yep. See ya. He's good. All right, guys. Switch up GoPros. The audio might not be as good, but I ran out of battery on my good GoPro. So now I'm using this GoPro. Hopefully, we'll get some more fish. But just warning you guys, the audio might not be that good. Fish, big, good fish. Oh, that felt so big. It's a decent one. Dude, when I set, I thought it was huge. I just started my camera, bro. That's still a good fish, though. It's like a two. Oh, he's mad. He's, oh my gosh, he's mad. Oh my, what the hell? All right, I gotta get him up. He's gonna snap me off. All right, I got a bunch of salad now. 
Oh boy. Alright guys, I got him. Oh no, oh no. No, let him, let him swim. He's gonna get me wrapped up even more. I got Here, I gotta pull him up. You got him? Oh, you're gonna snap. You're snapping. Oh boy. You're snapping. You're snapping. Grab it, grab it, snapping. grab it, grab it, yes. Yes. Alright guys, solid bass, probably two pounder. Decent one. Bloop. Oh, he belly flopped. That wasn't good. There he goes. Oh, that was fast. First cast at the new spot. Tiny little bass. See ya. There's 10 right here. What you do is you gotta cast past it. You go, got one. Is that a good one? Oh my gosh, he put up a hell of a fight. Another little guy. Dude, it's stacked right here. Guys, it's stacked right in this little pocket. Another tiny guy. How mad would you be if I got to I'd be pretty pissed. Oh, I got one from in there. A, what? a tiny snake. Did you see that? I literally just dropped my bait straight down. And started jigging it. And a tiny snakehead ate it. Tiny little snakehead. Look at the patterns on these little guys. See ya. Oh, got one. Guys, Darkon just hooked up with another fish. There we go. Alright guys, another little bass. I'm See ya. You. Yo. Oh, I got one. Hey, another bass. Another little bass. On the text of Rick Senko. See ya. Oh, got one. There we go. Another bass. Alright guys, there we go. Another little bass. Let's drop him back. See ya. Oh, he gave us a jump. All right, let's hopefully get another one. Oh. There we go. Another bass. Little guy. Man, I thought it was big. He hit it harder. See ya. Alright guys, that's gonna do it for the video. As you can see, a weightless wacky rig obviously won the competition. It caught way more fish than the Texas rig, but a Texas rig is way more versatile. And if you put a bull weight on top of it, you can catch some giant fish along with numbers. So that's my personal favorite, but if you're just going weightless, a wacky rig is definitely the way to go. So thanks for watching, hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time on the next episode of Fish Report.